More than 300 delegates from over 100 countries from all over the world were inspired to engage with the young generation. A number of sessions took place at the Sydney's World Congress 2014 in Rome to complement the theme Media for a Culture of Peace, creating images with the new generation. Here are the reports from the VJs. Seguinis World Congress 2014 was opened by Augustine, the president of Seguinis World. Augustine stressed the central role of youth who are deeply connected in the IT world. He questioned the implication if the church fails to reach out to them. The future of the church depends on this generation, my friends. This generation is the most technological savvy generation of all times. We call them the selfie generation. Monsignor Claudio Maria, the president of Pontifical Council for Social Communication, said the media is the makers of a culture of encounter. Over 300 Catholic communicators from over 100 countries are gathered at Domis Passis Hotel for Signis World Congress 2014. Delegates from more than 100 countries brought forward their challenges to find effective measures to their problems. Despite coming from different backgrounds, the delegates were guided by the theme Media for a Culture of Peace. And this is what some of the delegates had to say. One of the challenges in Signis Asia is the challenge of migrants, refugees and undocumented people. Strong message from one of the delegates to this challenge was We need to share and to keep networking with each other. New media for social communication is one of the workshops today by the speakers from various backgrounds. I, I think that the participants of this workshop should share together the way we can understand, we can use uh, new media. The speakers highlighted the world is changing, thus the term new media seems inappropriate. News.va is used to demonstrate the point. I liked it very much because that was very useful. After the opening ceremony, participants took part in a series of workshops. One of them is social marketing. It's uh, positioning from just giving the envelope and giving funds, money for donations, and to engaging the people in the parish. On the first day, Signes World Congress had four workshops. In one of the workshops, they dealt with Catholic social documentary referring to the past, present and future. The speaker of this workshop was Larry Rich from USA, a former executive producer of radio and TV for Merinol, accompanied by Peter Dunn from Ireland, the director of RADA. For me, cinema is storytelling of the human being in different cultures, different societies. But people going in cinema have also a deep feeling for such kind of question, more than we can think. This seminar was really good. And numbers of people from around the world talked about the ways they were using movies and find out how they can be helpful in their search for meaning in their lives. Father Carlo Crispi is a Salesian of Don Bosco, who was sent to Ecuador in 1926 and dedicated his life for the poor there. The documentary about this priest premieres today. We decided to premiere this film on Father Crispi in Signis. It was produced by the Salesians in Ecuador, and since they had produced it and their members, they asked if they can show it for the first time, if they can premiere it at our Congress. And we're very proud to premiere any of the great works of our members. To crown the day was an invitation to an after dinner of cheese and wine to commemorate the founder of Craig, Father Pierre Babin, Lorenz Jorogi for Signis Vijay.